Lead It brings together countries, companies and international experts to achieve one mission, net zero emissions from heavy industry. Each year, more countries and companies are joining the group to decarbonise industry. Industry accounts for over a quarter of global greenhouse gas emissions, and Lead It is one of those organizations that really bring together governments, industry, and stakeholders to, to work together to figure out the path forward to decarbonize these hard to abate, hard to address sectors. We need to work together with industry, with finance, with governments to find the right solutions to be able to keep 1.5 within reach. I know we can do more. And this is a prime example of how we can do more. South Africa has also been focusing on the hydrogen economy. And we're currently in a space where we are exploring the options that may be available both for the domestic market as well as the international market. Kenishi Husada, State Minister of Economy and Trade and Industry, Japan. Japan joined the initiative in May this year. We believe that it is beneficial to collaborate from all over the world, particularly in hard to abate sectors. I think one of the things that really came out of the session and the conversations today um, was that we need a crisis mentality. We've seen what we can do when we have a crisis during the pandemic. We need that same approach if we're to deliver industry decarbonisation at the speed and scale required. And this is a really important role for the leadership group or lead it. Today we heard very daunting numbers that the Mission Possible Partnership put out on, on what we have to have by 2030. 100 green steel plants, for example. SSAB started the hybrid initiative that uh, took the lead in the transition steel industry and the uh, leadership group Steel Tracker that really helps to spread what we're doing here in Sweden, show to the rest of the world that there is a way to decarbonize the steel industry in a way that people might have thought not possible in the past. Yeah. India and Sweden launched the leadership group of industry transition in 2019. As a part of this initiative, we are working on development of promoting sector-specific roadmap for low-carbon industry transition. Industry is the key stakeholder in the same specifically hard to abate sector. Their own initiative, knowledge transfer and cumulative effort will help in achieving the objective. We are witnessing the power of the green industrial revolution. Lead it has become a world-leading forum for public-private action to decarbonize industry, building global momentum for a green industrial revolution. Forward-thinking companies in carbon-intensive industries like steel and cement are moving quickly to become part of the net zero value chains of the future. This progress is dependent on political leadership that will enable green technologies to reach commercial scale within this decade so that all countries can address the climate crisis in a way that creates jobs and builds lasting economic growth.